my seat. First for the day. What up folks? We are doing some cheater fishing today. Uh, wind is, well, it's kind of died down, but the wind has steadily been blowing that way, which is a pain because I come from that way, so I'm coming right into the wind. But one of the cool things it does when it does that is takes this corner and blows all the junk out of it uh, and kind of gets it going down that way. So normally the river flows this way, so all the sticks and grass and stuff kind of get caught up in this area, and this is normally almost unfishable, but today it is. Um, so I stopped, I got some live bait, and well, I, I netted some live bait, and um, yeah, I'm just down here going back to the basics of a bobber, a little weight, a uh, little gold hook, and a minnow on it, and I was gonna put it out and get my camera and everything ready i threw one out there and i think it sat in the water for three seconds and cork went straight under it was a little 10 inch bass so there's stuff in here man i would i don't even know if there's crappie in here i would love to get on a good crappie bite and put about i don't know the limit in kentucky was 30 but i don't know if there's crappie in the Guadalupe I know there is in Canyon I know a lot of people go to Canyon Lake and fish for them maybe I'll have to go there but there's some brush piles and stuff down this way so I figured I'd try this for a little while and I got I don't know maybe I don't know I got some 15 17 I figured I'd try some here and then go down that way I need to put some more water on them and in the true spirit of living in New Braunfels I got me my worst fest, and I use this to dip water in my minnows. Maybe it's good luck. We'll find out. Stay tuned. Normally, whenever I'm fishing with live minnows, especially when I'm using a cork, I like to hook them through the tail, and I'll show you why. And get right in the back of the tail, and go through like this. And then, when they're in the water, they fight against the weight. So the weight's trying to pull them down. So they're going to just pull, they're going to fight it. They're going to swim up and away. It's a really good presentation, especially if you're crappie fishing. That's how we used to always crappie fish. I hate those things. That's right. I got him. It's those stupid. I don't know if they're paper wasps or what they are. They try to fly in your mouth. Oh. <laughs> Hey, that's a nicer one, right there. He came out of nowhere, didn't you? Okay.
Hopefully that wind will stay. Here we go. Oh, it's hitting like a crappie. Was it? What is it? No, it's a little bass. Damn it. Man. It's going to get cold here in a few minutes. He finally took it. He played with it for ever. Yeah, no. Come here. Come on. That's a decent one right there. A decent one right here. There you go, boss. Get out of here. I'm pretty sure that was a gun. I don't know what he's shooting at. Hope it ain't me. Twenty-seven foot right here. Look at that. Look at the fish. Holy cow. He just spit the bluegill out. I need this bluegill back. That's my bait. He just spit that bluegill back out. Oh, got it. Ah, uh, oh crap. I caught a bass. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, I got that rod now and I ain't gotta put this thing up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jeez. No, 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 there we go. <sighs> Guys, I don't think this is a crappie. <sighs> nope. Not a crappie. Busted my knuckle. Come here. 
He'll keep. What y'all think? I had a minnow out on bottom. And I caught a blue cat. Okay. There we go. Anything over here? Uh oh. Uh oh. Something's trying. Got it. Got it. Got it. Well. Not a crappie. Still. Not a crappie. Alright. 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 Chill. Chill. Out of here. I think it's a girl. That's a whole lot of pink. Congratulations. Come on. Got to be something in here. Need to come down here with some worms and some little gold hooks. Also, not a crappie. Tag on. He came out of nowhere. Okay. Now that the wind's died down, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to float out that way right over this deep hole and just drop one of these because I only got a, like two or three left. Just drop them straight down off the side of my kayak and try to fish them that way. See if I can keep from getting hung up because I've lost. A lot of hooks today so that's what the next plan is all right last since last minute I got we went through this whole thing of them we're gonna drop it down 26 27 foot of water here we go <sighs> See you later, buddy. All the way to the bottom. All right. Dead. Looks like it. All right, folks. I think that's just about going to do it for me. Since the sun has went down a little further, it has gotten exponentially colder. And to be honest with you, I just don't really like it. So we got those catfish um, take those home with me and maybe we'll do something cool with them I've been wanting to do a smoked catfish dip I got the recipe offline uh, it's from a restaurant that was really that is really popular in Kentucky um, and they did a smoked catfish fish dip cracker dip and I think I kind of want to try it and see how that turns out so uh, anyway 
Hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and we will see you all later on. Have a good night.